Hi everyone, welcome back to U-Boat. Here we are, back in a rain-soaked and dark and miserable port. Ready to go again. We've just reloaded all our torpedoes and all that uh, food and uh, re resources that we require. And the upgrades completed. The new conning tower with our... Have we, has the... Um... Ah! These are the breeder 13, 22 millimeters. Thirteen point two. Does say thirteen point two. Ah, that's how they work. Hey, they're temporary guns. Oh, there was I was last time thinking I'd been ripped off, but no, brilliant. Okay, thank you, Captain. Thank you very much. Uh, how do I get him to uh, to leave leave the position? There we go. Look. There and then it, ah, so they're temporary guns we put on there. Gotcha, gotcha. That makes a lot more sense. Good. I don't feel like I've been quite ripped off by the uh, the deck hands it, uh, or the, uh, the the dock workers. Um, okay, I think let's quickly check on how the rest of the crew are doing. I think they're doing okay. We haven't really had much in the way of action for the crew to get too worked up over in the last um, few weeks. So they're absolutely fine. We've got yeah. Full uh, accomplishment. That's, that's all good. Check on the leading I'm officer. Really Let's see where our mission orders will take us today. Uh, let's have a look at the small orders from the Admiralty, please. So we've got Port of La Rochelle Flotilla. Travel to the Port of La Rochelle was not where we were based previously. Now yeah, we don't. We don't leave the Med just yet. We got uh, two areas of patrolling sector CP, one medium difficulty, one high difficulty. Obviously, there's going to be 250 kilometer difference. We'll go for the medium. It's like we haven't really challenged our crew. Right, Captain, are you on board? Wait for the captain to come back on board. There we go. Yeah, he's on board. Excellent. Right, we'll start. Um, Plotting to leave town then. Uh, let's get. Underway. Right, excellent. We'll come out of port. Come down here. Right, where are we going? Where's CP? CP. Oh, it's right over here, right near um, Egypt. So, uh, and the port of Alexandria. So, that's quite interesting. So, all the way past Italy once again we go. Past Malta. And down into Action Zone. Excellent. Right, let's get a rumbling. West is on the um, electric motors. And for the moment, I think uh, the Capitaine can go and do some navigation. Excellent. Right, we're going to rumble on. Fuel's going down. Batteries are being charged. Uh, Fatigue is going down. Why is fatigue going down? We've only literally just set out a tiny bit out of port. It's ridiculous. Um, oh, that's looking nice though. Look at that. I love the light across the water. Very nice indeed. Um, anyway, let's... What was I going to do? Right, let's... Um, have a Felix West is doing that. How are we doing? Um, so, Leo, as you're coming through here, come to the storage room for a second, bud. What have we got in the... Uh, come to the storage room, please. That's an order. Thank you. Oh, my good God. Stop what you're doing and obey me. <laughs> Christ's sake. Uh, let's get some... Uh... Come here. Leo. Seriously. Can we execute an officer right now? We're misbehaving. <sighs> Transfer that in there, please. <sighs> Where is he? He's there. He's there. He's doing it. Good. Oh, he's winding me up then. He's actually doing it. Yeah. Oh yes, cheese is in the galley. Well done. Okay, 
while you're there, uh, put some fresh vegetables in there. Put some fresh veg. Oh, it's full. Okay, stand by. You can go back and do whatever you want to do. Oh, right, okay. Okay, first little bit of a confrontation with one of our officers. It's going to start well. We're going to plow on now. Fingers crossed uh, all should be well. Thanks once again for all your support. As always, hit that thumbs up if you want to see some more. And uh, thanks for uh, all your subscriptions and the, uh, the comments as well. It's much appreciated. Right, we'll press on and I'll see you in a bit. Hi guys, aircraft inbound apparently. Right, we've got the guys, let's um... Whoa. Uh, we haven't got time to um... Let's keep turning. Full speed ahead. Oh yes, aircraft up there. Yeah, they look like fighter aircraft. We're on one of the side breeder guns. We've got the captain on the, uh, the main flat gun to see what they're going to do. We're just speeding up and turning as we do that, just to present more of a difficult angle. Let's see if they're going to come back. If they're not, if they're just going to continue on their just um, reconnaissance, then I think I can't see. Oh, there's, 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 there's one there. I think they're going over. We're going past Malta, and that's probably why where they are, and they're probably from Spitfires from Malta. Also, actually, what time in the war are we? Could be, we may not have the Spitfires yet. And I think if we get Cola onto the navigation, Captain, you go, um, I don't know, you go, you go to bed for a bit, and what we'll do, we'll, um, we'll send that in. Slow down a bit, and let's go to periscope depth. Dietrich is just going to continue to have a smoke by the looks of it. He's uh, no one's budging him from his uh, his smoke break. All right, Wagner's run through to do the old the valves, so we should be dropping down shortly. And I think we've got away from them. Okay, I think disaster averted. Issue is over. Uh, the pressure on the... What was that? I didn't read that. Pressure on the something, 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 something. Alright, hang on. I don't like that. Uh, service to boat. Uh, Dietrich, there he is. He's still having a smoke. There, oh, there you go. Buoyancy is too low to walk on the conning tower. Oh, is that what it was? No, that wasn't what it was. It's Dietrich is just having a bath. This is how we bathe our sailors. Yeah, he's very reluctant to use the, the bath, so that's how we have to do it with him, unfortunately. Right, anyway. Uh, aircraft gone. Uh, we've moved around. Let's uh, replot where we were going to go. Um, and we actually need to come over here and go that way. Right. Two speed. That's fine. Surface the boat. Yeah. And um, hopefully we'll get turning correctly now. Good. Right, we'll, we'll press on. Hopefully no more challenges along the way. Hi everyone, welcome back. Yes, we've been going along at Dexawash. Wash. All things going grand. Let's just surface the boat a little bit. We've reached the patrol sector, so we're just going to send that one in back to HQ to let them know where we are. Uh, fatigue is set in, uh, but that's okay. Um, he's doing the valves. That's all good. So we're here. We, I suppose we've got to better plot ourselves a little search pattern to get the uh, 250 uh, kilometers sorted. We're going forward. That's grand. Right. Let's have a quick look. Capitaine, come over here for a second. We've got old Eric in here. I think we're back down to our tin food. Well, that went quick, didn't it? We need to take some more food, definitely. Our guys seem to have a um, ravenous appetite. Right, 
Alright, let's have a look in here. Yeah, okay, let's have some veggies in there. Crikey, they eat a lot. They eat a lot. Yes, we're not being limited by our fuel or anything like that. We've been limited by the food now, so we, we have to remember that we need to take a lot of food in future. We're not taking enough. I think we've tweaked it slightly. Um, anyway, while they're doing that, and that's been sent back to HQ, uh, our research has been completed. Literally bubbled up a few minutes ago. So, uh, researched improved toilets. That has been completed. We can have some uh, nice toilets now, I'm sure, with some... Um, Scented uh, candles and uh, something else. I don't know. Research has been completed. Visit port to blah 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 blah. And the GHG Balkan has also been completed. Nice. Right, let's get some more research going then while we're at sea. We have um, sonar decoys, equipment production, uh, radar detection, military stash, conning towers, armored conning towers. Let's get armored conning towers. I like, especially in the med. You're absolutely right. In the med, we need some armored conning towers. And here we got accumulators. Well, we need the engineer for that, so we can't do that. Ammunition production. Uh, equipment production. We'll go for the radar because I think that's going to be the sound guy. Oh, excuse me, we've got hiccups. Right, 12 days. Excellent. So we've got um, armored conning tower mark two. And we've also got the radar Bulkram being under investigation, which is grand. Excellent. Right. Let's just um, get the air pumped up. Let's get that going. Can we get that going? Lovely. Excellent. Right. Uh, it's early early doors here, so we're, we're going to continue on our patrol. Hopefully, hopefully very soon we should see... Um, no, very dishy is lovely. Uh, some contacts. I'm going to send Hib Hibbert to uh, to bed and um, the captain can do some navigation for a while. Good. Well, we're going to mo mosey on then and uh, hopefully complete our patrol designated distance and uh, we I'm expecting us to get a, a radio message. Although I am just going to send my radio man to bed. He's looking quite tired for a bit to see if there's any uh, Empire Tower, Empire Explorer type critical mission techni technology on a ship somewhere and see what we need to do. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, welcome back. Patrol completed. Not a single ship was spotted. Wow. Um, the Med is proving to be quite the dull place. Um, Alright, we've done the port raid in Alexandria. So. We're going to come around here and see if there's anything. There's been literally nothing. I mean, I was hoping for a little bit more than nothing. <laughs> Not one single ship. Not even a, a you know, a, the, um, the hydrophone. Not even one tiny ship did we hear or we even detected so far. Either there's something slightly weird with this or I don't know. It's, it's not. It, there's nothing here. <laughs> it feels like there's nothing here whatsoever. Uh, but we'll hug hug this coastline. Hopefully, uh, if we hug the North African coastline, something may appear. It may not. But um, yeah, we'll see where we go. Yeah, I I don't know what to say. This is nothing happening. We may need to leave the med because um, I'm I've been less than impressed. I'll be honest. I've been less than impressed with the med. Um, I'm gonna send you to bed again. Yeah, and uh, Captain, you can go to bed. Cola, go to navigation. Good. Right, we'll press on then and uh, hopefully find something. Otherwise, pff, I don't know. We're definitely going to leave the med if this is going to continue because this is pointless. Absolutely pointless. So, um, yep. Anyway, we'll continue on. I'll see you in a bit. Hurrah, hurrah. We found some contacts. Yay. We're just going to send those in now. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Uh, Adam, go on to the hydrophone get listening um there we go lovely let's have a look let's have a look at what we found can't see them yet but we've got two merchants up ahead somewhere actually they're probably there they are we're actually turning to go and face them so i'm not sure if they've seen us as yet Captain. let's have a look uh they're gonna be over here somewhere there they are 
there they are. What are they? It's uh, there you go. I thought it crashed for a second. It's a freighter. Brilliant. Um, Empire. I don't know. With the two ships moving behind each other, or well, yeah, next to each other, it's kind of distorting the thing. I think it's an Empire, something or other. We'll figure it out. Where's the? Where's our um? Our book here. Is it an Empire Tower? Yes, it's an Empire Tower. Right. Okay. That. If we can lock onto it, there we go. Um. So if we set the range. Oh, this could be a challenge. Oh god, hang on. It's gonna be about about there. Uh speed. If we set that Oh the the, dif the difficulty is that we're turning, so I'll hold off on doing that at the moment. And they're currently looking like uh that to us. Right, we're going to move into okay, position, uh, hopefully get a little bit better. Um, let's come down to Dexter Wash for the moment, and then we can um, go fully submerged in a second once uh, he's finished his fag. Right, okay, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, we're doing the timing on this ship now. We just we have submerged and the captain is on the periscope. So we just let the, the ship run through the uh, crosshairs from start to finish and click stop when obviously it, it's passed and uh, we should be good to work out his time. Sorry that kind of ticking short loop always throws me off when it stops. Almost there. So the captain's worked out some uh, basic calculations. You can see them in brown at the bottom. But we'll get this done properly. Oh, uh, where's the wave going to go? There. Brilliant. Four knots. Okay, lovely. Let's do the stado meter thingy again. Because uh, we've kind of uh, moved position and... Uh, oh, no, not that one, sorry. Uh, that one. Gets the sh the waterline of the shadow ship, or the ghost ship, at the, the top of the mast. Which is about there. Which gives us the distance. Uh, now the angle of the boo. And the boo angle is... I'd say probably about there. So if I come... If I leave that position for a moment and I come to the map, I'll probably get a better angle. Yeah, that's, that's not too bad. That's pretty good. Where are we? We're there. Okay, good. Uh, the captain has... Why is the captain... Did I just... Oh, sorry. I think I just got the captain off the periscope. Which is not very helpful. Not very helpful at all. Where's our ship? Uh, he always brings it. He's very particular, this captain. He likes the uh, periscope to be just above the tip of the water. But me, I like it so they can see it. <laughs> and I can see without being hindered. Right then. Let's bring up the old torpedoes. Let's flood to tube one. Rohr 1, bebessern. Rohr 1, bebessern. Fire. Fire. Excellent. And oh, where's the other ship? Is it still behind it? Oh, it's over there. I'll have to look at that one in a second. Right, so torpedo is away. Oh, we've got our research has been completed as well, I've just seen. Something else we need to look at. Let's just see how this is going. Looks good so far. Oh, uh, yeah, looks good, I think. Course of these coordinates. 
Bestätigt. 20 Sekunden. Come on, let's get a Trevor. Come on, Trevor. Come on, Trevor. Fingers crossed. Oh, Trevor's got a little drum kit. Minimal damage. Why is it always minimal damage? Always, always, always. Any fires on deck? Can't see anything, so we'll fire another torpedo at it. Fire. I can hear the little lunch bell is going. I think they got dinner time on the uh, on the ship. Not a time to be serving up while we're firing a torpedo. <laughs> but Trevor will be coming for lunch, boys. Trevor's coming. The health is of the ship is dropping slowly as obviously water rushes into the hole, into the hold, where we just put a hole into the side. Twenty seconds, boys. Is anybody keeping an eye on this um, torpedo? Guys, anyone? Anyone? I guess not. Der Torpedo ist auf halbem Weg zum Ziel. Covered half the distance. Okay. It's a little bit further out than I thought we were. We were then. Ooh. Forty seconds. Here we go. This is what I was waiting for. I thought I thought the guys had stopped uh, monitoring our our torpedoes. Thirty seconds. Yeah, health is dropping, obviously, for the water going in, but uh, it's not dropping fast enough. If we, had, if we had fire on board, then you know it'd be great. Well done, tube one loaded. Excellent. Is Trevor coming for tea? It's a long ten seconds, isn't it? Was that missed? It's a miss. Right, there's that. A bit of time has passed. Okay, a bit of time has passed, and uh, we're coming alongside the ships now. We're chug chugging away. Where's the other one over here? There she is. Let's have a look. What are you? Let's get the old identification book out. Oh, N1, uh, NA1, apparently. Let's confirm that. I've, I've no doubt that they are right. Yeah, it looks right. We'll recognise that. There we go. Um, we'll get the old angle of the dangle. About there. I think we give him a torpedo and then we'll get up and fi finish him off with a deck gun. I think that sounds about right. Oh, I'm just delighted that we've actually found some ships in the Mediterranean. It's it's been a it's been a long time since I felt like we've got actual traffic in the uh, in the Med, which is nice. Oh God, might be a bit choppy for the old deck gun. Lovely. There's the speed. And his course is, yeah, about that. Lovely, right, flood tube two, please. Fire. It's quite high in the water as well, isn't it? It's very choppy today. Must be a high wind or something. How's that looking, boys? It's on target. So we, we've come. Where are we? We're there. So we, we've come sort of between them the two now. Oh, stop putting the periscope down. I need to see. I know. 
a lot of people always criticize is like you should fire the torpedoes put your periscope down and hide well yes but I'm making a video at the same time so you gotta appreciate that I, I want to record the visuals because most people will want to see the visuals they've seen the movies and they always see the torpedo hitting in the periscope you know I know it may not necessarily be accurate to how it was but it's kind of like the the filming way of things again we've missed haven't we it's there Ooh, was that just in front of it then okay um in that case flood three I don't think I've missed this many before. Oh, he's turning. Oh, no. Didn't mean to do that. Let's change the angle of the dangle. I don't think... I think he's a little bit... Like that. Fire. If we miss this one, then... Um, we'll just... Deck gun it. We'll try and brute force it with the old deck gun. Alright, let's have a look then. Let's have a look on the old map. Is this is this one going to be anywhere nearer? It's a minimal Trevor, a minimal Trevor once again. Right. Um, good. Fine. 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 Uh, let's just quickly have a look at the. Um, except these, so that's the uh, conning tower, and that we'll we'll figure out what we're going to do in a second. Um, wow, we've got some glass-sided uh, conning tower here. This is pretty funky. Oh, let's get out of that view. Uh, let's surface the boat. Blow the tanks, surface the boat, and we'll finish those off with the old deck gun. Slow, slow down to um, slow speed. Right. <laughs> Dietrich's still having a smoke. Oh, look, and his name's upside down. Oh, no. Hang on. If you come over this side, his name's upside down. <laughs> Sorry. Simple things for a simple mind. Right, um, switch to diesel engines, cola, hop on the old, not the flat gun, I beg your pardon, no, sorry, not the flat gun. Where's the deck gun? Oh, hang on, is it not above water yet? There we go, try now, no, are you going to tell me it's going to be too choppy to use the deck gun today? No, there it is, good. Excelente. Come on, Hilbert. Hop on the gun. Make the Navy proud. Right, hop on here. Let's give him a couple of guys. What have we got? We got high explosives. And we are bouncing all over the place. Boom, good hits. Right, let's try and get these decks on fire. No, I think that went straight through that gap, actually. Oh, it's really choppy. This may not have been the best idea in the world, actually, thinking about it. So we got a good hit there. Oop, that was a bit over. That bucked at the wrong time. Good hits. Uh, you can see the blackening on the side of the ship now. If only, it, if only it would catch light. Tube three loaded. Lovely. I thought you were going to tell me the uh, ship's on fire. She seems to be. Um... Fire on deck, brilliant. Let's switch round to the other freighter. Where is she? There she is. Try and get a fire on this deck. Whoop. 
Yeah, the uh... I think the deck gun lets it down a little bit. I like a little bit more... I don't know, it just feels a little bit... of an afterthought. I like have a proper range finder and everything, rather than just trying to judge it with your eye. Excellent. Right, that one's ablaze, and this one's ablaze. Oh, is that one gone? That one's sunk! God, Christ, that was quick. I think that's sunk. There wasn't much holding that one on. We did pummel it a little bit. Whoops, hold on, boys. Getting a bit choppy. That was a bit low. Ooh. The, uh, the front mast has caught fire. No, it's, uh, it's out. Put it out. Don't worry. It's a bit short. Ooh. Uh, the the air is of, on fire around it. That's bizarre. And she's breaking apart. Lovely. No, stop. Stop. Okay. Um, go on navigation, please. There we go. Good. And you, your two guys can relax. Good. Right. Adam, get on the old radio. Those ships have sunk. Gone. Look at that. Within an instant, they've gone. Oh, this is far too choppy to use the deck gun in reality. Never mind. Never mind. Right, Empire Tyra sunk. 31,500. And we got the NA-1 ship sunk as well. Good. Oh, discipline's really uh, low. Okay. Um, let's make sure we've got... Wagner, do you want to come in the kitchen for a second with your oily, greasy hands and make sure we've got some food in there. There we go. That should keep them happy for a bit. Good. Right. Happy days. Oh, we got we, we did fit the snorkel, didn't we? So that's pretty good. cool. Um, let's get rocking and a rolling. We've got to do some... Uh, let's go to that. Let's get some headquarters first and we can get some uh, more things unlocked so uh accumulators or armored conning tower four wow um ammunition production let's get accumulators we'll get the engineer on that one and let's try and get should we get one of these military stashes yeah let's get a military stash and we'll get the leader on that one get some resources and res supplies and stuff excellent good right we're gonna make our way yeah they're gone um, well, it's a torpedo warmed up wandering over there we're going to make our way back to port get some upgrades and I think we'll um, take a medal or two uh, discipline is still falling fatigue no one's doing anything why are they fatigued right let's have a look see if there's anyone dodging responsible uh, Wagner oh actually is that you Oh, that is him. Okay, he's faffing around there. No, it's alright. Um, buoyancy is okay. Let's get the um, diesel thingy on to get some air. Now everyone seems to be doing stuff. It seems really reasonably calm. Everyone's quite chilled. Okay. They're just fa faffing around with the torpedoes. Right, we're going to press on then, and I'll see you in a little while. There you go, guys. We're back. It's dark. It's miserable. It's got to be home port. We're here. We've made it back. Fan tabulous. Right. Um, yeah, what a horrible, horrible, horrible day. So much so. Oh, we've actually docked in a, uh, a different dock warehouse and everything is over here. Look. Oh, brilliant. Okay, I didn't know you could dock in any, any of the... Um, Docks. Let's go to the leading officer and read about our last patrol. Thank you. So we got genuinely impressed with the scope of success of your assignment. We wish you all and your crew all the best. Tonnage sunk a thousand. Oh, that's probably within the patrol, isn't it? In the patrol square was zero because there wasn't a ship there. We were at 20 days at sea, um, but we got an extra 15,000 uh, budget and 75%. Um, renowns type favor reward. 
brilliant. So we've got some uh, levels up by the looks of it. Uh, let's ask for a few favours. We've got a... F ah, this is working now. This is in the patch, which is good. So we can have seven crew members on board, or we can have a free roam. Let's get the seven, seventh member on board. Right. Thank you for the moment. Um, and these three need to be levelled up. That's good. Let's go to the recruitment agent, and let's see. I think uh, a radio guy would be useful. Yada, 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 yada. Look, who have you got available to buy? We've got a leader or a radio man. Both would be really useful, actually. Um, a leader to rotate the... Oh, but I think a radio guy. The war deprived him of everything. He does not like people, but still finds himself in the service. Weirdo. He's, he's, he was born for our crew, then. Absolutely born for it. Excellent. Right. There he is, look, with his little, <laughs> his little rain hat on. That's brilliant. Right, Newman leveled up. So let's get him um, checked out his skill. So we went for a sensitive hearing and assignment before. Oh, if he goes to HQ, he's an expert. Okay, that's fine. That's not great, really, but fine. Um, West also leveled up, I believe. Uh, again, he's an expert. We'll get that one done. And he has a shave while he's there. Larice probably will have a shave as well. Uh, he's also an expert. Oh, that's... oh, it wasn't him who leveled up then. Oh, okay. He, had, he didn't have a shave. Uh, maybe it was Cola who leveled up then. Yeah, it was. He's a cook. No, no, he already had that. Uh, Wagner? Ah, yes, it was Wagner. So, salvager and handyman. Now, we've got two handymans, so we're going to have a salvager. And he's had a shave as well. We need to get him in here just to have a shave. The captain, uh, he gets connections. The officer meets all class requirements for Missions in the headquarters. Oh, that's pretty sweet, actually. And he also had a bit of a trim to his beard. Schultz, our new guy. Um, he can do cook or he can do radio man. He's already got radio man, has he? Or oh, he's got both. He's got both. Oh, okay. Um, do you know what? He can be the quartermaster for now. Yeah. Okay, good. Excellent. So that is our hapless band. We're going to get the um, Was du, Herr upgrades added. So what do we do? We had an upgrade to the listening room. We had the Balkan upgraded, didn't we? Brilliant. Uh, tier 2 hydrophone system consists of 48 hydrophones. I should have read it before I clicked on it. Uh, something on the dome attached to the bottom of the U-boat's hull. It's only one dead zone spans 60 degrees to the stern. Excellent. Right, so, improved toilets. Lovely. Improved hydraulic system that opens up the possibility for using toilets deep underwater. <laughs> Helps morale. <laughs> I, I, I don't doubt that. I don't doubt that for a second. Right, um, what else do we do? Anything in the radio room? We've got the, oh yes, the the Borkrum. Um Tier 2 radar detector. Doesn't emit any radar detectable for the enemy, but at the cost of detection range. We'll get that done. And um, what else? Anything else? Anything in the conning tower? Yes, the Type 2 armoured conning tower. Tier 2 conning tower. It's fitted with two 20mm double barrel double A guns. One on the conning tower, one on more of the separate platform. Right, so this is what I was expecting when we got this upgrade. I didn't realise we had those two little um, temporary breeder guns there. But, that is what we're like. Right. We've probably got a... Dis yeah, we <laughs> big gap in the side of the conning tower as that's been upgraded. Um, but that's all looking grand. I think that was all the upgrades we had, wasn't it? Anything else? Anything else? Anything on the diesel engines? Anti-radar coating snorkel? We've already got that. Yep. Okay. Um, electrical engines. Accumulators, we haven't got that. That's still under investigation. Good, I think we're good. Okay, there are our uh, upgrades done. Take a look. Now, we do need to remember that we do need so much more. Uh, let's get these loaded on. 
bits and T2s. Right, so that's good because we fired four. So, oh, I hate when it does that. Why does it do that? It's really annoying. Um, we should all be good. That should be enough because we need fired a few torpedoes. So that should be everything. Um, Food-wise, we need all the food we can get. I'm thinking let's let's sell those. Can we? Do I have to go to ammunition to sell them? Apparently so. And we'll get some more food. We'll get some bacon. Oh, the smell of bacon going around a submarine must be amazing. Uh, we'll get rid of that as well. And we'll get even more food. Uh, cheese. You know my guys love cheese. Excellent. Right, I think we're probably good to go again next time. We'll just have to wait. 11 days we're going to be off duty, but never mind. We'll get that pass in the matter of moments. Fantastic. Right. We'll leave it there on this stormy night back in port. Thanks ever so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. Uh, we will give the Mediterranean one more chance. If it doesn't give anything too, too exciting, then I think we're going to have to head back to the uh, North Atlantic and have some fun there because it's uh, it's not doing it for me at the moment but we'll see what comes up in the future right but for now we'll leave it there thanks so much for watching hope you enjoyed this as always if you want to see some more hit that thumbs up and uh, I'll bring some more videos of you but your way and if you haven't already consider hitting that subscribe button and tickling the bell with all notifications so you get the next video release sent to you fantastic right thanks so much I'll see you next time